Let's start our new lesson in chapter three, which talking about compare and order decimals. All of you, please open your book, page 163. At the end of this lesson, we will be able to use the place value to order and compare the decimals. So in this lesson, we're gonna compare and we're gonna order the decimals. Now, in the last lesson, we said that if we have 2.38, this is a decimal point. This is a decimal number, sorry. And if we have 2.39, and I want to compare now between them, which is greater. In order to compare between them, just you have to put them under each other, like 2.38 and 2.39. Then you will start now comparing from the left, from the ones, like they are the same. They are the same. Now here, they are not the same. Which is greater, eight or nine? It's nine. So I will say now, yeah, so I will say now that 2.39 is greater than 2.38 or 2.38 is less than 2.39. This is here the most, the idea of our lesson, how to compare or how to order. You have three uh, numbers, how you order between them. Let's start now. Now, all of you, please open your book, page 163. Now, the table lists some of the mountains in the United States that they are... Okay, page 163. Okay, the table lists some of the mountains in the United States that are over two miles high. How does the height of Cloud Peak compare with the height of Boundary Peak in Nevada? So here I want to compare between the height of Cloud Peak and Boundary, Boundary Peak. Cloud Peak and Boundary Peak. How you compare between them? Here we have two points. 488 and 2.495. I want to compare now between them. So what can we do? As I told you, you have to start from the left. Compare two with two, they are equal. Four with four, they are equal. Now eight with nine, which is greater. Nine, so that's mean the second number is a greater. So since nine is a great, uh, greater than eight, so 2.495 is greater than 2.488 or 2.488 is less than 2.495. So the height of cloud peak, where's the cloud peak? This one is a greater than the height of the boundary peak. Is it clear? So it's greater than the height. Yes. Okay, I will. I will after this uh, lesson. I will send. Ah, but it's okay. And you mean now to to have just a second, please. Um, I will send you you know one by one uh, on the chat. Okay.
Okay. I send it now on chat. Yeah. Not teacher, I send it. After Hunada, Hunada wrote page 163, I sent my uh, screen. So here now, here you have that you can use another way. It's the same, just write them on the place value. Then say two equal to four equals four, nine equals nine, five greater than three. So that's mean since five greater than three, so 2.495 is greater than 2.493, and 2.493 is less than 2.495. So that's mean the height of cloud peak is greater than the Wheeler peak. Do you have any question? Okay, now, here we're gonna now order the decimals. Mount Whitney in California is 2.745,000 miles high. So Whitney is 2.745. Mount Rainer in uh, Washington is 2.745. 729,000. And Mount Harvard in Colorado is 2.731 miles high. Order the heights of these mountains from least to greatest. They ask me now from least to greatest. And which mountain has the least height and which mountain has the greatest height? What do you have to do? You will write them under each other, like two. 2 .745, 2 2.745, 2.729, 2.731. So first you will write them under each other. Then next, two equals two equals two. Seven and seven and seven. Now here, what do we have? Four, two, and three. So which is the least? Two. So this one will be the first one. So 2.729. Then what is the next? What is greater than two? Is it four? Uh, sorry, between it will be three. The one that's between is 2.731. And what is the greatest one? Five. Yes, this is, will be now number three. So since two is less than three, is less than four, I mean these numbers. So that's mean 2.725 is less than 2.731 and is this than 2.745. So which one has the least high? Mount Rainer in Washington. And which one has the greatest height? Wink. Yeah.
Here you have to order. What do you mean by order? Write them under each other and then see. If they are equal, go to the next digit. If they are equal, go to the third digit. Here, what do we have? We don't have, have the same. They are different. Four, two, and three. Which one is the least? Two. So the one which has number two will be the first. Then what after two we have? We have a three. Well, the one which has three will be the second. And which is the greatest? Four. So the one with four would be the greatest. That's it. Okay. Now next. Now all of you please open your book page um, 165. 165. Okay, now. Rahat? Where's Rahat? Noora. Noora. Matab. Yes, Matab. Use the place value chart to compare the two numbers. Which one is greatest? Here you have three and 472 thousands. Three and 445 thousands. Let's now let's compare between them. From where you have to start? Sorry. Start from. Okay, Matab, please, uh, see, please, can you test your mic, check your microphone or test your microphone? There's some noise. Okay, let me up. Yes, let me up. Here, let's compare. Three equals three, is it right? And Bravo. Seven and four, are they equal? Or it's greater or less? Greater than four, bravo. So that's mean which one is the greatest place? Three point four. Bravo. The one that have seven in her digits is the great one. Thank you so much. Now, Huria. 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 Hanin. Yes, Hanin. 4.563 and 4.536. 563 and 4.536. Yeah, let's compare. Four and four, they are equal. The next. Oh. 
So what does this mean? Which one is greater, the first or the second number? The first, bravo, thank you. Now, Israel was? Yes, Isra. Here we have five and 640, five and 64. Yeah, let's compare now. Five and five. Then. Yeah, wait, six and six, four and four. But here we have zero, here we don't have anything. So in order to compare, what should I add here? To make them have the same, add zero, bravo. To make them have the same number of digits, to compare between them, you have to add zero. Then zero and zero, they are equal yet. So that's mean, which one is greater or less than or equal? Bravo, they are equal. Thank you. Now, um, Hala Bashar, Hala. Eight and 673, eight and 637. Let's compare now. Bravo. So which number will be greater? Bravo. Yeah, please mute your microphone until I call your name. Now, page, um, we are still in page 165. Name the greatest place value position where the digits differ. Here, name the greater number. So here what we have to do, we have to check what is the greater number and what is the, I told you this page 165. So here, you have to compare between these two numbers and then tell me in which place value they are different. What do I mean? Like here, we have three and 579, three and 564, okay? Hunada. Yes, Hunada. Okay, let's compare between them now. Bravo. So this is the greater. Yeah, now he asked you now what is the greater. Now in which digit, okay, the, the, uh, the, the digits they are different. In which place value? Are they on ones, on tens, on hundreds, or in, in thousands? In hundreds, you, you can say teacher in thousands too, but I use the hundreds to compare. So the digits, the digits that I use it to compare is the hundreds. Thank you, Hunada. Now, Muna. Muna, here what do we have? We have 
nine and five hundred seventy two, nine and six hundred thirty seven. Which is greater? Bravo. This one. So nine point six three seven. Now, in which place value the where the digits differ? Bravo, intense. Bravo. Number seven, Dina. Yes, here. 4.159 and 4.152. This is the greater. Bravo. Bravo. Thank you. Bravo. Okay, now yes, Sarah. Just a minute. Just a minute. Please let's So here first, you have to write them under each other. So here, what do we have? 4 .08, 4.08, 4.803, 4 and 4.038. Now first, in order to compare between them, as I told you before, them have the same number of digits. And I mean here, one have one, two, and three. To compare between them, let, ha let them have the same number of digits by adding zero. Now be careful. When you add zero to the right in the decimals, it doesn't matter. It doesn't make any change. Okay? Yes. The next. Here, what do we have? Let's compare now between them. They are equal. They know to the tenths. Yeah. In the tenths here, what do you have? Yeah. Now, which is the uh, which is the least and which is the greatest? That we have zero and three and zero. So, which one is the greatest? So from here, you can say that which one from the the first digits, which one is greater? Eight. So this one will be number four. I mean the last one. Which one will be less than any, um, not the greatest, less than the greatest? A three. So this one now will be number three. So here, after that, I will close this one and this one because I don't want them. It's already compared. Then now I will go now to convert between this one and this one. What do we have here? Eight and three. Here it is. Uh, just a minute. Here it is one and here it is two. Yeah, then now we finished, is it right? Let's now rewrite them. Four. So which one is the begin the first? Bravo. Less than.
zero eight. Yeah, then four point. And then four point eight zero three. That's it. Is it clear? Okay. Now, uh, Sarah. Yes, Sarah. Please now do number nine. One point. Then next, here you have three. You have to add zero in order to make them have three digits. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Then. Yes. Yeah. They are the same, so I cannot compare it between them. Can I? So can you tell me which is the greatest? This is seven. This is, so will be this will be number four or the last one, and this will be number. Three. Bravo. The next now I will compare between this one and this one. Now. Here, we, we will close this one and this one because I already compared between them. Now we have three and seven. The greatest is seven. So this will be number what? Number two, bravo. And this one? Number one, bravo. So now let's rewrite them. 1.037 is less than uh, 1.73 is less than 1.37 and it's less than 1.703. Yes, that's it. Do you have any question? Okay, now tomorrow we're gonna complete number 20, 21, and 22, and we will solve 23 and 24. Then you will start our new Okay, okay. I... Bye bye. Have a nice day.